Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to export all collection in MongoDB. So see right here, this is the collection, total collection or file. So I wanna export all the collection. So right here, or you get export and import option. So about the import that I already discussed. So let's see about the export. So right here first. So first we need to select the collection. Okay, selected. Here after click on export. Now here after, so I wanna use uh, add here SQL. So if I click uh, next, so add here I'm getting the error message only export single collection or view. So if I select add here Mongo, click on next. So add here you can or uh, do the things. And here after, if I select uh, CSV and here, so again the same error message only one collection or view. Also add here CSV or SQL and here to another collection let's so it also not supported at here or to another collection and here this format export with MongoDB so this option at here it's a support now here after you can use the JSON also so if you select at here JSON export multiple collection and views into JSON files so you get this option here now here after click on next now here uh, we have uh, two different options. So first is JSON Mongo Cell Studio export multiple collection and views into JSON files. And here this is about JSON Mongo export. So whatever your option like, you can select it here. So you can use this option or this option. Okay. So let's uh, select this option and here or uh, mark this one. Now here after click on next. Now here after or uh, you have to select uh, where. That the directory there you want to select. So I'm going to select inside Mongo and here after click on select and here after so let's check back. No, no need to change anything. Now here after click on next. So add here or uh, this is the directory selected, it is not empty perhaps. So it contains override and future. So let's click on yes override. Okay. Now here after or uh, click on start export. Now here after let's uh, check the mongo so mongo folder directory is there now here you can check check at here at this point so this is the mongo so inside collection one two total five collection are there so five total five collection successfully imported now if you want to check at here or uh, 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 documents here so let's uh, click on more and you're selecting notepad so this is the document inside there so all now here after departments this is for departments and here this is for EMP and here this is for employees so this is the way we can uh, export all the collection documents inside Add here, this is the way, and the next option is let's check one more. So, add here collection and your export and your JSON. You can find and here this time this is selected. Add here, let's check by JSON Mongo cell here. So, this time going to change the directory this PC and you're selecting on PHP. PHP here after click on next, override here, click on start here after or uh, check inside PHP. So, see, add here, this is the contents. So if you use add here this option, so see outputs it's coming at your different way like ID here department ID like this. Okay, so uh, this is the difference between add here by selecting or uh, JSON and here JSON after. So this is the difference between these two. So this is the way we can export all collections or documents inside mongodb so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you